All right, are you ready for this? Yes, very ready, Episode. very ready. Le let's uh, go. Let's do this. I'm ready to go. <laughs> What's going on guys? It is the Phantom Michael and I'm bringing you episode number 7 of our Pokemon Let's Go Eevee and Let's Go Pikachu Go Lock. So I said Let's Go Eevee first because obviously I'm playing Eevee. Ah. DJ Spinda can can do what he wants. On the last episode you guys, we got out of Mount Moon, we got a brand new encounter, we explored Cerulean City and now we are about to take on Nugget Bridge, scoop up an encounter, meet Bill, we'll see what happens there. We got told by our rivals some crazy stuff happened. So before we do anything, let's do a quick team recap. DJ Spindo, what do you say? Sure, let's do it. All right, up first on my team, I have Big Beth the Geodude, followed by Venus the Beth. Bellsprout. Sp I got Hawkins the Spiro. I have McLeod the Eevee. I have a warm tail, the Rattata. I have a yellow jacket, the Beedrill. And that is it. What do you have, Dylan? All right, first up, I have William the Butterfree. I have Laranda, the Rattata. I have uh, my starter, Cheeks, the Pikachu. I have Captain Jack Spiro, who is almost dead and poisoned. Uh, and then I got Tatiana, the uh, Magikarp. And Xavier the uh the geo dude so yeah that is the right spot. on all right i'm gonna go back and heal before i take on another Same bridge for here. sure hopefully you don't step and die well i'm gonna go ahead and uh antidote up here that's a good idea i shouldn't have told you because i'm kind of nervous about that bertha or xavier oh no who who's poison captain uh, jack? that was captain jack spiro yeah never mind he can't die that is the coolest nickname i have never heard before <laughs> right Okay, and we do have a chance to get a static Bulbasaur, but we need to have 30 Pokemon. Oh, yeah, let's check our Pokedex and see how close we are. Yeah, 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 you're right. Pokedex. This is the first time we've ever opened the Pokedex, so that's <laughs> huge. Um, I have, I need nine more Pokemon. Uh, let's see, where am I at? Pokedex, Pokedex, Pokedex. I need nine more. I've got 15 obtain, obtained, so I need 15 more. Goodness, you need to be on that catching mons grind. I guess. All right, so who's going first out there? I got Beth Hawkins, Yellow Jacket, McLeod. I'm going to put Yellow Jacket up front. Why not? Why not? Why not? Let's get Yellow Jacket some stuff. Oh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I got William oh. up front. It took him a minute to see about that. Yeah, we'll leave William for now. We'll go with William. Oh, William. Uh, this first trainer looks like a bug trainer. Never oh, it mind. is a bug trainer. Let's do Captain. Using a Vino Hanat. Let's rock out with Captain. I need to fix the Yellow Jacket's name. Yellow Jacket? It's it's a lowercase yellow jacket, and I don't like it. Oh. What's the chance this, this little Venonat has Psybeam? Does he have Psybeam? No, he has Supersonic. <laughs> Thank gosh. Thank Osseus, who so, doesn't exist in this game. Exactly. Well, he does, but he's, his existence is not known of. It's not known in this little plane. Of town. We just be simple village people. Not that, not those village people. If you know what I mean. Mm. So, so let me tell you what I heard the other day. Okay. You ready? I'm ready. So, uh, I was doing some, you know, some looking through, you know, uh, I follow this guy who does like, uh, he keeps up with like, dude. I never noticed Vinet's eyes turn dark after it passes out. That's crazy. Oh, that's kind of um, creepy. I was watching this video and this guy was talking about old um, Cartoon Network cartoons, right? Okay. So I was I was interested. So I watched the episode and he starts talking about he he made me remember one of the, my favorite episodes of Ed Ed and Eddie. Did you ever watch that show? I did, yeah. I mean, I, I wasn't dude. real consistent with it, but I watched good bits of it. My dude, 
that he, for one of his little uh, gifts in there, you know, as he was talking about it, it played the episode with Ed's dressed up, and it's they pretty much taken Rolf back to like they rebuilt an entire city in an old construction yard that looked like Rolf's village. Yep. So they, they were playing the, the old folk song, "That's My Horse." <laughs> Let me tell you, that was great. Yeah. That was. What is the chance this Psyduck has confusion? I don't know, but I just knocked it out, so... I'm going to McLeod, and I'm going to use another one of its hidden moves. So, when you battle trainers, does the rest of your party actually get experience? Because I feel like I'm not getting yeah. any. Yeah, they do, man. They do. Wormtail gains some levels. Let's see what Buzzy Buzz does. Buzzy Buzz. That was a little different. That looked a little bit more special than... Uh, Sizzle sl slide or something. Sizzly, Sizzle, sizzly slide. Yeah. Well, it's it's bouncy, bouncy slide. Sizzly slide. I don't know how it goes. One of the four. Sand shrew. Well, I misread that. I was not expecting that kid to have a sand shrew, so I led with the geo dude. <laughs> oh goodness. Oh, I can finally see the other one. A uh, sand shrew. Is it sand true? Do you say sand true or sand shrew? I say sand shrew. Yes. Because it's a shrew. See, my entire life I've called it sand true. Sand true. See, I think that's. Sand I think that would be harder to say. Shrew. Sand shrew. It's a. Shrew. Did I tell you about me catching a shrew while in North Dakota? Uh, no, I did not. I do not recall. I did not know shrews had venom. Uh, is that consistent amongst all shrews, or is that just, like, certain shrews? Uh, uh, apparently North Dakota shrews. I mean, that would explain the uh, whole poison sting thing with sand shrew. That would. I never, you know, because not a... Dude. Dude. Never. I'm not going to tell you this. Little secret that I found out about this one attack that Eevee has. Yeah. So, it's pretty lit, man. So, I'm, I'm going to save it gonna save it um but anyway I found it as I was ice fishing and I picked it up and put it in my pocket cuz I'm like oh this little thing might need some saving you know what I mean yeah found out it was a full-grown shrew uh, didn't need saving man almost bit me and then <laughs> I looked it up because I didn't know what it was because it didn't look like a mouse I was like what the heck is this thing and I read uh, shrews careful if they bite you you might need to go to a hospital <laughs> Well, that's... They carry disease and they are venomous. It's like interesting. Oh, he flinched my Gia dude. Okay, that's convenient. Yeah, fake out. No, he's just getting really lucky bites. Mm. Dude, poison uh, on the first twin needle. That's what's up. He got another flinch. He's two for three right now. Dude, I just murdered this meowth with. Twin needle. Whew. I just uh, threw a rock at him, so you know. You know how Did that... I ever tell you my my baby beaver story? I don't believe you have. Okay. So one night I was working in the store, right? Gotcha. And you know what a muskrat oh, is? Oh, I'm familiar. Yep. Okay. So the I had this high school kid that was kind of like my. He was the kid who like cleaned up everything and did like all the uh, maintenance style stuff, like kind of like the minor stuff that needed to be taken care of, right? Gotcha. While while I dealt with like more customer service, more, you know, just ensuring that the building was getting secured before everybody left. So and he had to check with me before he went home for the night, right? Okay. So anyway. The kid leaves. We're about to close down. It's about 15 minutes till closing. We got maybe one or two more people in the store. The kid comes back inside. He goes, Mike, I found a baby beaver outside. Hmm. I said, what? He's like, yeah, as we were driving by the, because uh, they had the rec center. And when you went to go past the rec center, they had these two ponds because there's a cow pasture down there. And he said, it ran across the road. We didn't run it over. We caught it and we put it in the back of the trunk. <laughs> Do you know how to take care of a baby beaver? Because we don't think its mom is around anymore. So, uh, we talked to... 
I, I see the beaver, and I'm like, oh my god, I've never seen a baby beaver before. I'm shocked, right? Yeah. Then a guy comes in, an older, you know, rugged-looking fellow. After the after the dang thing had chewed out of the cardboard box they put it in, it's running around the store. The ladies in the store are screaming, jumping on top of stuff because this this, mind you, massive rodent is running around the store. <laughs> I grab it by the tail. It tries to bite me. I throw it inside of like this metal can, this big old metal can, and this old man comes in. He goes. That right there, son, is a full-grown muskrat. Wow. And I'm like, no, no, it's a baby beaver. He's like, son, look at that tail. I'm like, yeah, it, it flattens out as it gets older. I had no idea what I was talking about, but I thought I was <laughs> right. Till I looked it up and I looked like a dumbass. I'm sure. But uh, we just beat the Nugget Bridge. Yeah, we did. Uh, by the way, kid, uh, how would you like to join Team Rocket? That's right. I like, We're a I like group the music of change. Dedicated to doing evil using Pokemon. Want to join? Are you sure? Come on, join us. I'm telling you to join. <laughs> I love how the camera okay. gets closer. You need convincing. I'll make you an offer you can't refuse. It just like had to be in the guy's feelings right there. I know, right? What was he upset about? I have no clue. I don't know, but he was pretty bummed that we uh Refused we his refused. offer. Yeah, he was pretty upset to join about his it. lame group. I don't, I don't, I don't want to join a group where I only get Zubats and you know, <laughs> yeah. Ekans. Zubat and Ekans. Rattatas. Wing attack. Mmm, eat it up. A nationwide organization only has Zubats and Rattatas. I think they'd be able to provide a better Pokemon than that. Yeah. They're just a cheap company. What can I say? I don't get how a 10 year old can go out and catch whatever Pokemon they want, but Team Rocket either has to steal them or, you know what I mean? Yeah, or like, you think have you just, them given to them by other people. You would think that it'd just be like, okay guys, uh, I'm pretty sure there's a, a habitat of, oh my goodness, okay. There's a habitat of Squirtles living over here. Let's send 15 guys to go check it out. Right. Alright man. Just poach all those Squirtles. <laughs> no problem. Alright, I have to switch back into McCloud because that absorb does way too much, and if he crit absorbs me, I'm dead. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> well, I already won that battle because, you know, Pokemon Master You're trying now. To... Oh, okay. Buzzy Buzz. Death. I just used Zippy Zap, so... <laughs> this is the only trainer I've ever seen that has three Pokemon. Right? Even the gym leader didn't have three Pokemon. But our rival had three Pokemon. That's true. That is very true. You are very correct, sir. Did you finish beating that guy yet? I have to beat one. Go ahead. You can read okay. his dialogue. With your skills, you could become a top leader in Team Rocket. Come on. Think of the opportunity, kid. You shouldn't let a chance like this pass you by. Capiche? How about you don't tell me how to live my life? I just turned down the opportunity of a lifetime, Mike. <laughs> I would have said yes. There's a Charmander up ahead. Can I have it? I want it. I'm not good Dude. at raising Pokemon. I feel sorry for my Charmander because it's not getting stronger. So I want to give it to, you, to a better trainer than me. Are you interested? Yes, sir. Yo! You, Yo! I've caught 50 Pokemon. You should catch more than that. And that's all he says. So. We have to have 50 Pokemon? <laughs> yep. Oh, man. That means we are going to have to come back. Oh, dude, here, we get an encounter. We do. Route 24 encounter. Yeah, I'm going to write this down right quick. That makes me wonder, dude, because his, his little icon was the same as that other one. So I wonder if... Uh, we have to go back and battle that one guy on the other side of Mount Moon after we get cut, obviously. Oh, I ran into a trainer. And well, that's convenient. I dodged him. Okay, my eyes are closed. Route 24. Here we go, baby. Okay. Oh, I ran into a trainer with my eyes closed. Nice. <laughs> Dang it. Dang it. Camper Shane. Camper Shane. With a sparrow. With a sparrow. 
Rock throw for the knockout. It was a crit. Total kill. Level 15 for Xavier. Let's get it. Let's get it started in uh, here. Oh, he wants to learn takedown. Mm. Takedown is a base 90. Oh. I guess we can replace tackle. One one uh, non-stab normal type move for another. Boom. Minus the recoil, I guess, but You're just learning takedown? Yeah. Alright, eyes closed. Let's do this. Okay. My eyes are closed. Oh, is there any dialogue after the battle? Nope. Okay, eyes closed. Alright, I encountered. It's a Vino net! Okay, I encountered. It's a Pidgey. And it's oh, tiny. Dude, that's actually. <laughs> that's actually good. I learned how to throw diagonally. Ooh, there we go. Great throw. One, two, All right. three. Oh, come on. That was a good one. That just, was a good one. Just so you know, if the Pokemon is on the left side of the screen, start from the bottom right side of the screen and throw the Pokemon diagonally across. Ah. Then you will catch it. Well, I caught that one that time, and he was right in front of me. Oh, I dropped my pen. The snozberries taste like snow. Okay, so I caught one. There's a Meowth right here. I can't I can't catch it. I can't put it on my team, but I am going to catch it. There you go. Well, I just caught a Pidgey. Yes. Uh, no. He was put in the box, so I'm going to write it down. So you have 14 more, I have 8 more. After I catch this, I'll have 7 more. Because I really want that Bulbasaur on my squad. <laughs> uh, let's see. It's a male Pidgey, so let's make a name for it. I'm digging the name Ace, as always, for my male Pidgey. That, that's what you should name it. Heckles, yeah. Top Gun. Top you don't gun. call it Top Gun. Top Gun is like a really good name for, like Star Raptor. Star Raptor, yeah. Oh, I oh I could have encountered a Psyduck. Look at the si Look at the size of that duck. Look at that size duck. Dude, a shiny Psyduck would be really cool. And this is a tiny one, dude. This thing is huge. Right. Three. Oh, ya bugger. You bloody wanker. Come on, ducky. Ooh. Ooh, excellent throw. Excellent throw. Nice. That's it. Big money, no whammy. Big money, no whammy. There's Big the money, capture. No whammy. That's what's good with you. I shall release him into the wild. Jeez. 140. And Captain leveled up. Well, there we go. Uh, we're gonna get. We're not gonna learn light screen. Sorry, bud. Boom, shakalaka. All okay. Right, yeah. I have to nickname some pokes. Some pokes. Okay, I have venom right here. Venonat. I name my venonats. Venonat was one and of your what? encounters. Yeah, venonat was my encounter. Sweet. Hmm. Oh, I remember. I named Venomat Venomoth Mothra. This right here, your ass is going to the professor. So are you. <laughs> Goodbye. I almost sent away the Pidgey I just caught. <laughs> that would have been terrible. I would have laughed. You would have been sad. Yeah, I would have been a little bummed. A little bummed. Alright. There's a Sprout Bell right there. A Sprout Bell? As in a bell sprout. Oh, we got another encounter here, Route 25. Oh my Closing goodness, Closing my eye Dylan. holes. Let's do it. Let me let me write it down. Vino oh, I just got an encounter, didn't even see what it was, it just came right up to me. Route 25. It is a Pidgey. I have a Route 25 encounter, mine is a Pidgey. I just got a Venonet. So we traded. <laughs> yes. <laughs> 
Goodness, oh gracious. Uh, oh. <gasps> do you want to give up my catching this Pokemon? No, I do not. There we I don't go. Know what button I mm. hit, but that was not the right button. One, two, three. Oh, you bloody wanker, you. Did it run away? No. He just broke out of the ball. That's great. two, three. Oh, he did it again. All right, what am I naming this? Pidgey. One, two, three. Hey, hey, there we go. Hmm. Laranda just leveled up. And wants to learn Super Fang? Yes, please. I'm naming my Pidgey Edge. Edge? Are you edgy, Mike? Like a Devi. Deji. Brand new Pokemon to Z Dex. I'm gonna have to come back for that Dagomon. Yeah, that uh, Charmander. That Bulbasaur, man. Well, that too. Dude, that was a level 12 Venonet. That's pretty sweet. Alright, let's change your name. I like the name... Specs. Let me know if you remember what that's from. <laughs> oh. Don't remind me. Don't remind me. Okay. I have to f I'm fixing Yellow Jacket's name. Okay. I'm battling the trainer. What time do we get, Dylan? We're at about, just about 23 minutes. Nice. He's got an Onyx. Whoa, we ain't messing around. Catch it. I come out with a Geodude. <laughs> Funny. You, we join Team Rocket. Seriously though, what am I supposed to do to this thing? I guess I go into Cheeks and hope he doesn't have a ground type move. You know what the next episode is? Uh, probably Bill. We might have, we might have a gym battle and we might meet Bill, have a gym battle and do a go tournament. Yeah, it'll be a busy one. Dang, and that's all yours right there, man. Yes, sir. That's all you. Oh, he just got rage. I ain't worried. What was I scared of? Dude, that's a level 14 Onyx, though. That's better than Brock's. <laughs> oh. Come on. Come on, Bellsprout. Boom. Get smacked. Get smacked, Onyx. Too bad you don't have an Absorber anymore. Ha ha ha. You're funny. What happened to that Pokemon, uh, I've got a, Dylan? I've got a double kicker, so how you like me now? I found a super podion. There we go. Youngster Chad has a Diglett. What is with all these ground types that could potentially screw up my G dude? I really need that magic card to evolve, is what I need. That's what I need right about now. You do. It's what I need about now. Need about now. Sand attack. What's he gonna have? Sand attack, growl, and scratch, probably. Ooh, that's a dig. It's weird seeing Diglett without hair. <laughs> yeah. Double kick. Woo! That's a one hit. One shot, McGraw is what they call me. Ugh. That totally wrecked his life. Youngster Chad. Youngster Chad. I like this guy's hat. Yeah, we got Farmer Brown over here. Mm. Bird Keeper Joey. 
Pittsburgh Keeper Toby. Oh my goodness, a Pidge dude, Pidgeotto in this game Ooh. looks really good. Looking clean. Now here's a Pokemon Xavier can fight. <laughs> what level is this thing? Well, it's a flying type, so... It's level 15, no, no, though, what? which is kind of crazy. Oh, yeah. Dude, that actually makes me a little nervous for the gym, because we're, like, a little over-leveled right on par. I think I'm going to slap a potion on me right quick here. Just in case he tries some cheeky stuff. You know he will. He's a cheeky little de deacons, you know that? Cheeky little birdie over here. Wing attack. That's resisted. Bird Keeper Joey. Smack. Catch this rock, boy. Catch this rock. Oh, with your face. He caught it with his face. Right in the throat. Level 16 Geodude. Just a Dan. What a good little Geodude. I love my Geodude. Everyone should love their geodes. Geodudes is. I think I'm gonna lead with Beth when we go into uh, the gym. You're gonna lead with your rock type? Yes. Wild. I want my geodude to learn magnitude. That would be pretty fly. That would be fly. Do we not get dig till after we beat the gym? Right. No, actually, it's after we beat Bill. This is the part of the game, dude, where in, like, the other gyms, you could literally go anywhere after this part. You don't even have to do the gyms in order. You could skip Misty because Misty doesn't let you learn cut after it's, uh, uh, uh Brock lets you learn cut. Oh. Dude, Xavier's just taking over right now. Boom! Get smacked. Boom! Goes the cannon. Rattata is uh, fainted. Let's try something wild. The youngster here. Danny. Dude, there's uh, quite a bit of trainers over here. There's my a friend. ton of them. What's our time? Uh, 28 minutes. We can battle a few more. I yeah, I think we got like three more. This guy's got two months. That's not bad. Just gonna heal up really quick. Battle this mountaineer with my Venus. Dude, rock types are really not good for my team. Your Magikarp's not level 20 yet? No, he's only level 12. I'm a, I'm a little upset Goodness. about it, which is why I'm like, oh, he's setting up on me. He's stealth rocking. I see, I see. Dude, the animation for stealth rocks is freaking cool. Have you seen that? I need to use that. I need to use it. Wow, that's pretty crazy. I think one double kick will do the trick. Oh, not even Whoa, close. Whoa, dude. Whoa. Isn't that cool? Stel dude, that is really sick, actually. I need to knock out this G dude before he bides my Pikachu. I would cry. <laughs> I would have the best day of my life. <laughs> That'd be so bad. So, you're going to put your starter in, right? Totes. <laughs> For the next one? Machop. I should have switched into my flying type. Dude, Zippy Zap animation looks so freaking awesome. I know, I'm jealous. Ooh, I forgot about Stealth Rocks, dude, and it, like, really destroyed Hawkins. <laughs> I, I bet. We got this. We got this, Hawkins. You can take him out, man. Yes. The Hawk. The Band of the Hawk. The Band of the Hawk. I wonder what that's from. The greatest movie ever. <laughs> There's only one band, and it's the Band of the Hawk. Ooh. No other band even compares to the Band of the Hawk. <laughs> do you want to join? Do you want to join the band? Oh, totes. 
do you want to give your soul to another man <laughs> so he could become a demon? That sounds like a good weekend. Sounds like my Friday nights. <laughs> Dude, I think there's a, like a few more, because if I remember correctly, there's a, two more like right beside Bill's house. Is there? Dang. Yeah. Well, in the OG games, there are. Does this Goldine have peck is the question. Yeah, she definitely does. It does have peck. Oh my uh, god. <laughs> okay. Die. You fishy. Dude, my Pikachu cheeks over here is level 19 already. It's kind of crazy. Oh my goodness, man. Are you trying to cheat or what? I guess. Oh, they make it so this guy doesn't spot you until he's just yeah. close enough. You can't sneak behind him to get that item. Good job, Game Freak. Thanks so much. Appreciate you. Camper he has Dustin. a squirt hole. Camper he Dustin. has a squirt hole. A squirt hole. I want a squirt hole. We're going to get one eventually. Probably going to take I'm us. Not. We're going to have probably gonna have to complete half the decks to get it, I'm sure. <laughs> yeah, because if I remember right, you get Ven you get Bulbasaur by beating Misty. You just get Charmander for free, and you get Squirtle after you beat Vermillion. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Can we not get the item? No, I told you. I, I got the item. I got the item. Oh, really? Dude, it's... Dude. Dude. Seismic if you cost? didn't get the item, if you didn't get the item, sucks to be you. Not even gonna tell me what it is, huh? It's T Wave. Oh, I have that with my Pikachu. Yeah, but I don't. And I have Stun Spore on my uh, on my Butterfree. Listen here, you potato. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh. Hey, you settle down there, Squirtle. Skull bashes brains out. You settle down there, Squirtle. Get him off your team. All right, Wormtail. Time to prove your keep. Or you're gonna go in the next oh go challenge. Oh my gosh, he's still alive? You're gonna go into the next go challenge if you don't win this battle. <laughs> that sounds really cruel, man. <laughs> my Pokemon have to earn their keep. Yeah. Are you still battling that Squirtle? No, I beat her. Dude, yeah, I'm battling this last person. Right? Oh my god, you almost died. Yep, we're switching. <laughs> You're fired. Whoop. Wormtail, say hello to the box for me. <laughs> hey, LaRonda's killing it over here. I believe it. Oh, I did get the item. Hey, hey. T-Wave. Sell it. Sell it. Just sell it. Sell it all. Sell it, so sell I hear it Fallout all. 76 is actually terrible. It's actually really terrible. They, Dude, they did the same thing with Elder Scrolls Online, yep. and it's terrible. I, I mean, I think Elder Scrolls Online is better. Um, but that's just my opinion. But... Uh, yeah, no, Fallout 76 is, is uh, kind of hot trash, so. Ooh. I don't like paint. Dude, you know how much Elder Scrolls Online costs right now? It's like $12. Really? Yes. It's kind of insane. For hot trash. I, li I like DSO. You we used to play ESO. See, we did, but my problem with ESO was that it was just... Everyone wanted Skyrim, but multiplayer. Well, uh, yeah, and that's all nearly impossible to get nowadays anyway, but... Did you see that Skyrim sold the most games across... Every time a new system comes out, Skyrim releases a game for it? I know. And they make just as much money as they made the first time they released you know, it. You know, and they charge 60 bucks every time they release it and re-release it for new yeah. consoles. It's like, really? I have it for, I have it for PS3... Uh, Switch, and I almost bought it for PS4, but I talked myself out of it because I got it for the Switch. Um, yeah, let's see. I have it for. Uh, All right. 
PS3. I, don't, I never did get it for PS4, and I don't have it for Switch, so I've only ever had it for PS3. When I bought my Switch, though, I got Legend of Zelda, Mario Kart, and Skyrim. Gotcha. So, did you finish uh, battling the uh, the other chick, or are you battling the fisherman now? Uh, I'm at the chick before the fisherman. Okay. I'm going to stop it right here for me. We're going to talk to Beedra a little bit. Do I dare take on the fisherman, or is it going to take me a long time? He's gonna take. Well, I haven't battled him yet. Oh, well, then you want to just hold yeah. up here then? Yep. We're at time right now. We're at 36 mementos. Mm. So, if you guys enjoyed this episode, please leave a like, comment down below, letting us know what you think. Did you like it? Do you hate it? Do you do you hate Dylan? Do you love Ooh. me? You know, let me know down below. And with that, you guys, I've been the Phantom Michael. I'm gonna get the heck out of here. I will see you in the next one. Bye.